hey guys and welcome back to my channel okay guys so today i'm going to head to michael's and go pick up some i guess some supplies um i want to go pick up some paint for my daughter i've been, like introduced her to paint and she's loving it so much so i need to go get like some kid friendly paint because the paint that i have I, I just don't know how safe it is for kids um i also want to get some art books I haven't bought one in a while like I have a couple like right there um but I think I'm like ready to explore some of the books and see what's out there so let's go Hey guys, I'm back from Michael's and I just want to show you what I got. Um, got like I said, I was going to get my daughter some kid friendly paint. This says three and up and it says non-toxic, which is what I was looking for because my child likes to put her hands in her mouth. It could be a little scary at times. So I feel like this is a safer option than like the adult paint that I have. Um, and it says it is washable. Yeah, washable paint. So, got that. I also got a little container we can squeeze her paint into and make it easy for, um, to make it an easy access for her. And I did get a book. Now, I will show you the selection of books that they had. It was a little scarce. It wasn't like as much as I thought. But I did find this book here. And it's got like... You can draw like some cute characters, um, little cute animals and stuff like that, which I haven't really explored much of. So this should be interesting. Yeah, so that's what I got from Michaels. We're gonna be working on a project, um, something different. I'm just trying to post some content on social media. So I'm just gonna take you along. Hopefully what I'm thinking comes really comes out cute and if it does then I can record and post it. I don't know if I'll have time to do it today, but I wanna at least get like the creative part of it out of my brain and onto something and then we can figure out like the video part of it later. So. Have you ever felt like there was something you were supposed to be doing? Like you're supposed to do this one thing. And every year that goes by, you just feel like, damn, like, why haven't I started that yet? I can't be the only one that has felt that before. <laughs> but I always feel like I'm supposed to be making these videos. And when I don't, I feel like I'm missing something. Like, I'm not doing what I'm supposed to be doing. It's like the weirdest feeling ever. It's like this feeling like you know it's so weird to explain but it's like like you just know and there's no excuse for it because you know better like what do I really know I don't know I just have this feeling that I'm supposed to be doing this so that's what I'm doing call me crazy if you want but that's how I'm feeling right now. <laughs> you got that something that can't be seen. You got that one thing that's hard to come by. It's not your styling. It's not your jeans. No, what you got is deeper within. And your friends don't even know what you got. They just hang with you because you earn a lot. Why don't you get a little closer and see what I'm working on. So this is what I'm working on. This is an old illustration that I created. She's actually right here on the wall. You can see her. And I think it's so cute. I love her outfit. And I feel like my daughter should have an outfit like that. Let's create this. Let's get rid of... So this is what it looks like. Isn't that such a cute overall set? 
And I'm going to draw it on an actual character, so that's what you see on her right there. Where she's got like this big cookie in her hand and stuff like that. So yeah, I think it's just so cute. What do you guys think? Okay, so right now I'm just working on something new that I've never done before. That I've never done before. And I don't even know if it's going to work, but I figure I give it a try. I'm signing up for um, TikTok shop where you set up your business account on TikTok. And I, as an artist, I have like pieces that I like to sell. And I don't think like a lot of people have seen my art and maybe that's why I'm not getting a lot of sales. When I do put my stuff in a store, people buy it. They love it. It's amazing. But it's like a little harder for me to do it online for some reason. I don't know if it's because I'm not showing myself more, giving my story, like putting my all out there. Like, I don't know. But I figure let's just give it a try. So I'm just going to sign for, I'm just going to sign up for that right now. So let's give it a try. Okay, so let me just show you what it looks like. I'm not done with it yet, but I think it looks pretty amazing. Um, I have like really big ideas and plans, and I really hope that everything works out. So I don't want to say anything yet, but let me just show you. So let me show you what it looks like. It's so cute. It's so cute. Oh my god. Hope you guys can see that. Isn't she so cute? Oh my gosh, she's so stinking cute. She's adorable with her cookie. I'm not done with it yet, but I love it. Like, I love this outfit. I, I would totally buy this for my daughter. Like, look how cute that is. I love the colors. I love the scheme. I just love everything about it. So, that's what I've been working on today. So, yeah, that's what I've been working on um, since I got home from Michael's. And right now, I'm just going to sign up for TikTok shop. I just heard about it um and i'm just willing to try new things so let's see if that works for me So that actually was pretty easy, way easier than I thought it was going to be, so I'm really happy about that. So I did that. I can actually take that off of my checklist. I don't know if you're one of those people who actually needs a checklist. Like I have a checklist of things that I need to do for August, so I can take that off and that makes me feel good. And we're going to move on to the next thing, which is... I just want to start practicing some more like cute characters and stuff and it's always like people and you know maybe not everybody resonates with like a person but they resonate more with animals and stuff and I haven't really ventured into that world so I think this is going to be like a really good introduction to creating something cute like that. How adorable. So yeah I am excited to kind of get into this okay so these are the supplies that I've decided to work with right now I've got some professional got some pencils I've got my markers my Copic markers and I have this sketchbook with smooth paper um, I should probably get a smaller one something old in there I haven't seen that in a while um, yeah so it's like really smooth so we're gonna use that and then we're gonna use of course the new book that I got so I was just checking my email to see if I did everything and TikTok shop was pretty simple to sign up for and I'm approved to start selling on TikTok so that was pretty simple it didn't take all day it wasn't complicated um yeah let's see how what i can do with this in the future all right guys let's see if i can come up with something <laughs> i feel like i'm making this more complicated than it needs to be um i love that it has like step by step oh little raccoon look at this little raccoon is he cute and look at all the steps that it gives you. All these pay all these steps from here to here. So we'll give it a try. 
Don't judge me, okay? Okay, guys. I did it. <laughs> I was so proud of myself. All I had to do was believe in myself, and I did it. I don't know how, but I did. So, this is the, the book. Okay, and like I so this is the book. And like I said, there's like all these steps that they give you. Okay, and this is supposed to be your final result. Look at my guy. <gasps> Isn't he so cute? Oh my goodness, he's adorable. I did it. I'm so proud of myself. Oh, I'm so proud of myself. I, I'm so proud of myself because... I just never, I'm so proud of myself because I've never done anything like that before and I did it on my first try so hopefully this becomes like second nature for me just keep going keep going keep going you never know what you could do okay so I think I got a lot done today um I am gonna go and relax a little bit before I have to go pick up my child <laughs> And um, hopefully I can take like another class or something while we're hanging out and stuff. So yeah, this is where I'm going to end my creative journey today and we will get back to it on another day. See you guys. <laughs>